everyone, welcome to another video where we are going to continue being authors. So the last few weeks we have been focusing on our class story, 10 things I can do to help my world. And you've been doing some amazing learning linked to the story. So you've been recording ways that you can help our world. You have been making bird feeders and writing instructions. And this week what we're going to do is we're going to read the whole story. So I'm going to read it from the beginning to the end to you and then I'm going to explain what your task is for this week. So it is going to be one task but what I would like you to do is really think carefully about it and extending your ideas. So let's read the whole story right from the beginning. So 10 things I can do to help my world. So I remember to switch off the light when I leave the room. Turning off lights saves valuable energy and low energy bulbs use much less electricity. I try to turn off the tap when I brush my teeth. Every time you do this, you save 18 glasses of water. I always Put my litter in the bin. Tidying away litter keeps the world safe and clean. I shall feed the birds in the winter. Feeding them helps them get ready for nesting in the spring. I use, have a little think, pause the video, what do you think it's going to be? I use both sides of the paper. If everybody did this, it would greatly reduce the number of trees we use to make paper. So I know in year one, we love to draw. We're very creative, aren't we? We're always drawing, we're always colouring. So I think we need to remember this. Always use both sides of the paper. I remind my mummy have a little think, pause the video, what do you think it's going to be? To turn off the TV at the wall. Electrical appliances still use energy when they are on standby, so we have to make sure to switch um, off the electricity at the wall. I enjoy, what do you think it's going to be? Pause the video. Making toys from old boxes. We can reuse lots of things before we throw them away. And I know somebody in our class has already made a robot out of boxes. I like, what do you think this could be coming out of the engine of the car? What could it be? I like to walk to school, very important. Avoiding car journeys saves fuel and means there is less air pollution. It is also good exercise, so we need to try and walk to school. I can, so we've got little pots of soil and an open pack of seeds, pause the video. What do you think it could be? Plant seeds and help them grow. What have we been doing for our science? Learning a scientist, this term in Arnco, we've been planting seeds. Plants help to keep the air clean and healthy and you need to remember to water plants, very important. I help, let's have a think about what this could be. So we've got plastic, food, and I'm presuming that is glass and paper. So why do you think there are lots of different bins? Pause the video, talk to a grown up. Where do you think they would go? To sort the recycling. So we've got glass, cans, compost, plastic and paper. So we need to remember to put the right rubbish in the right bin. Over half of our rubbish can be recycled. It takes much less energy to recycle something than to make a new one. So it says, all because I love my world. And that is the end of the story. That's the last page. So I want us to remember.
remember this picture because this picture links really nicely to your Walt for this week as authors. So I love my world. So let's have a think, okay? So remember that picture, pause it and have a little chat. You're gonna be trying to reinvent this picture, okay? So your Walt for this week is to research and record. So can you see my whiteboard? Hopefully you can. So research means go on the computer or you could use an iPad or you could even look in books and record, so on paper, record. So what I want you to do is draw your very own world, okay, in a poster. I thought you could write, make a poster. So draw your world. And then around it, I want you to draw four or five, or more if you want to, ways to help the world. So you wrote your ways at the beginning in your diary, but now you're gonna record it in a poster. And what I thought you could do is you could go out on your walk and you could stick those posters up so everybody can see the ways you are going to help the world. So I've got turn off the tap, save and put away the litter and walk. Now, we all know those ways from the book, but what I thought would be nice is you can actually go on the computer and you can research some different ways. So it doesn't necessarily need to be from the book you could find your own ways, okay, and record it in a poster. So your Walt is to research and record today. So after you've watched this video, I'd like you to go off and record, re research some new ways, okay, on the internet with a grown up, and then you can start recording it in a poster, okay? Now you can make the poster as colorful as you like. You might decide to do it in an A3 piece of paper so it's bigger or an A4. It's up to you. You might decide to do it on the computer and design it. That's absolutely fine. But this is the end of our class story now for this term. So this is the last little bit of learning you will be doing about it, okay? So that is the end of our video. Remembering your Walt, okay? Remembering to try our best and keep being authors. And please remember to upload any of your learning onto the Padlet because I love to see it. And I will see you soon for another video. Bye everyone.